What's going on plugins welcome back to another video in today's video I'm going to talk about Trenton Flowers and Louisville basketball and an update on Tyler Johnson Before we get into this video make sure you drop a like and if you're new here sub to the channel and become a part of the family Now let's get into the video Trenton Flowers is a five-star prospect He was in the class of 2024, but he reclassified to the class of 2023 He was a top 20 prospect and committed to Louisville Kenny Payne was excited to get a player like him. He labeled him as a program changer. This was Louisville's highest recruit in the 2023 recruiting class, but it was reported that Trenton Flowers is leaving the program to pursue an opportunity to play professional basketball in the NBL, which is the Australia National Basketball League. Recently, AJ Johnson did the same thing. He decommitted from Auburn to sign a contract with them. It was rumored that AJ Johnson was probably gonna do this, so many people wasn't shocked, but nobody expected Trenton Flowers to leave Louisville a few days before fall classes started. Trenton Flowers has made it clear on social media that he wants to play point guard and learn how to run a team, so I feel like he might have made this decision because Louisville wasn't going to let him be a point guard. They're mostly going to use him as a shooting guard or a small forward. He signed a contract with the 36ers. The head coach said this about him wanting to play point guard. For someone who's 6'8", he has great vision and poise. Unlike most kids his age, Trenton has the ability to play the game at elite level, and I can see him having a similar impact like Josh Giddy and LaMelo Ball. And I gotta agree with that statement, he could have turned out to be like one of those players, the team is invested in him and trying to develop him into an elite point guard, so he feels like this situation is what's best for him, that I'm all for it, but most Louisville fans wasn't happy with his decision though. He said that it wasn't an easy decision to leave Louisville because this was his dream school. He also thanked the coaching staff for helping him this summer and he thanked his teammates. This is a big loss for Louisville. This was supposed to be a prospect that was going to be a superstar for this team and change the program. Kenny Payne was giving him high praise during summer workouts. Kenny Payne was disappointed that Trenton Flowers is leaving and he gave a statement saying this. We fully believe in the University of Louisville's ability to help student athletes reach their goals, including playing at the highest levels of professional basketball. We're confident that Trent could have achieved his dreams by making Louisville his home. However, we wish Trenton and his family well in all their future endeavors. So now that he's gone, what's next for Louisville. They still have a solid roster and recruit class coming in, but the backcourt and wing position for Louisville is going to take a major hit not having a talented player like Trenton Flowers on the team. Also, I want to point out him leaving the team this late puts Kenny Payne in a tough spot to replace him because the school year and the season is about to start soon and the transfer portal is not looking good right now because all the big names signed the schools already. This was supposed to be a bounce back year for Louisville and right now it's not looking good for the program. Incoming freshman Tyler Johnson is still not with the team. Team. All freshmen moved in back in June, but Tyler Johnson was not one of them. Kenny Payne gave a statement saying this, we're still waiting on the process to get finished. Feel good about it, but we'll see when it's done. He declined to say exactly what the process was, but rumors are circulating that it's academic related. Tyler Johnson might be ineligible to play college basketball. All we know is there's a lot of speculation that he has bad grades from high school, and that's the reason why he's not with the team right now. Louisville can't afford to lose another talented player. The only true point guards on the team is Sky Clark. They need guard depth. That was their downfall last season going 4-28. So we'll see if Tyler Johnson will be playing college basketball or not this season. Did Trent Flowers make the right decision leaving Louisville and going pro? Will Louisville lose another recruit in Tyler Johnson? Drop your opinions in the comments. Drop a like on the video and sub to the channel. Turn on post notifications so you know when I post. I appreciate y'all and I'll see you in the next video. Till next time. Come